Hello. So this is Dan here. Someone in the synthesizer subreddit asked if you could make a vibraphone type patch on the deep mind. Uh, so this is my attempt to create just that. So this is what it sounds like. Okay. So let's get into it and I'll show you how I made this patch. First of all, go to a blank patch or uh, initialize a patch, hold down program, share, I mean, program, compare, and it will initialize it. So it sounds like this. Right, first thing you need to adjust. Uh, so someone please tell me if you can do this, but I couldn't figure out how to send an LFO to uh, an amplitude level for oscillator one. So I could only do it for oscillator two for some reason. Um, so completely disabled oscillator one. And I've just got oscillator two. And I did find it maybe because there is an exact mark for the pitch sort of at pitch. I found it easier just to go down an octave. Um, sorry, I've got the frequency down. Why did I not? Okay, I'm an idiot. Okay, so this is what it sounds like. I've got the pitch down and the level right up. So oscillator two is just a square wave. Um, the sort of timbral qualities of a vibraphone, it is a lot muted and kind of a hollow tone. And so I thought the square wave was actually the best uh, wave to go with rather than a triangle or a sine wave, which, oh, actually maybe a triangle could have worked, but I found, I find there wasn't a lot of harmonic content in those types of waves. All right, let's adjust the amplitude envelope, so the VCA. You want fast attack, uh, a fairly slow decay, and then uh, sort of halfway sustain and a long release. So that's the key parameter. Sorry, I am on a VCF. Let's try this again. VCA, fast attack. Uh, sort of halfway sustain, sort of fairly medium decay and long release. Okay, next we have to adjust uh, is the filter. So the vibraphone is a lot muted in quality, so not a lot of harmonic content. So let's turn down the filter. Let's turn it up a bit. The vibraphone also is a mallet instrument, so you do need the initial kind of thud attack of the sound. To achieve that, let's use a uh, envelope, a filter envelope. So VCF and really fast decay, uh, like almost no sustain, similar release time. And then obviously you have to turn up the envelope, uh, filter envelope. And just, yeah, just adjust it. So in order to sort of match the vibraphone's timbral quality even more, I had to adjust the tone mod. Um, I think this is a pulse width modulation or something similar to a pulse width. Um, but yeah, just bump it up a little bit and it just changes the, the sort of tonal quality.
And you can experiment and go even higher. But I found just a smidge of it added kind of a woody tone. Okay, uh, vibraphone time. So obviously the vibraphone has this vibrato effect on the instrument. So sending an LFO to uh, the amplitude level is what is needed. So go into the mod matrix. This is a quick key. Hold the mod button and click on, I mean, push edit on the LFO2. I'm setting LFO2 and send, uh, and then wiggle the level on, on oscillator 2. And you can see LFO2 is being sent to oscillator 2 level. And now you need to adjust the, the depth. So I went to around about 63. Yes. And you can't hear it now because my rate is all the way, uh, it's really slow. Also, change the shape to the sine wave. So how to do that quickly, just hold down edit and just wiggle the fader to sine and have it fairly quick. Okay, so the three things you have to adjust now to sort of tweak the sound are the, the tone mod, uh, the frequency cutoff, and the amount of uh, filter envelope that you're, you're having. So let's just adjust those three things. Uh, also, key tracking. Let's put some key tracking on. So this is going to open up the envelope the further up the keyboard you go. So I can hear quite a lot of uh, sort of low frequency rumble. Um, so to uh, sort of eliminate that, just add a little bit of high pass filter on. Okay, lastly, this is a mono sound at the moment, so let's spread out the stereo uh, spread of it by going to VCA, edit menu, and then uh, adding some pan spread. So I'm aware that this is this is as, as close as I could get to a vibraphone, but it is kind of leaning more towards a xylophone and a marimba sound. Uh, it's much more woody in quality. I think with some FM, uh, you could have achieved more of a metallic sound, but as a deep mind is an FM, this is as close as I could get to it. So let's save this patch. I just clicked right twice uh, and we'll compare the patch I I designed previously so it's a little bit more muted than the one I just designed so let's just turn down the cutoff Maybe let's uh, add more vibrato. So let's go to the, the mod matrix and turn up the depth. Thank you. 
And there we have it, a vibraphone-esque patch on the DeepMind 6. Thank you.